I actually just got finished performing the 7600 mile maintenance on the bike and we are basically out just having some fun with it today I changed out the air filter even though it wasn't necessary I decided to put a K&N high flow air filter in the rest of the maintenance has been done and we are out having some fun it's a cooler day than it has been but that's okay I've had the proper gear for it I also decided to change out the tank grips I had the tech spec which were all fine and good but I did some reading did a little research watched a few videos and I decided to try out stomp grip and when I reach my destination I will stop in the parking lot and give you guys a look at the stomp grip tank grips they're a little bit more expensive than tech spec but they're about 40 to 50 percent larger than tech spec as well I got the clear they come in clear and in black it takes a little bit of effort to get them on and I will show you why once I get to my destination hey guys and gals well, I have reached a point where I can stop and show you what I've done to the bike. These are the stomp grip tank grips. And the reason I said it takes a little bit to get them on is you slowly peel back the paper on the other side and then you take your thumb and you kind of go like this pushing it forward and then you let a little bit more backing paper off and you press it but you got to cover all this inside and out for the whole length to make sure you don't get any bubbles but really really nice these protrude quite a ways and you get a real nice grip picture of them from the top they work really really well and now da, 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 ah, there's one here is the 90 degree valve stem I installed I did it on the rear as well but I did it on the rear because I had to repair a puncture and figured, well, now's a good time to do it. But then after I got the Rabaconda back out and had so much fun the second time around working it, I decided to take the front wheel off too and change out the valve stem. I have a small little video on that. It's not of the highest quality but I kind of cut the top off when I'm removing the old stem but you can see what's going on so I don't think it's all that bad I just didn't have the camera set up properly but I'm going to show it to you anyway check it out okay I'm hoping that you guys can see this I'm going to change out the valve stem on this one this is the original here you can see it's just rubber trying not to get in the sunlight so I'll just take my razor knife and slice right through it I'm going to turn this over so I don't cut into the wheel surface And there you have it, you just cut that off. Mm. 
And then you have this end here. You just pull that out. That's all there is to it. This are the valve stems uh, that I'm using. I already put one on the rear. This is what it looks like. You've got a 14 millimeter nut on this side. I'm going to have it facing towards the ABS, which means it's going to be facing to the left side of the bike. And the reason for that, I'm right-handed and it'll be easier to get to it with my right hand if it's pointing out towards the left. So let's get this baby installed. Okay, here we go. I've got it installed. I've got it facing out to the left. And I'm just going to tighten this nut down. Well, okay, hopefully you can see that. Right here, nice 90. You just torque the nut down from the inside. Make sure that it's perpendicular to where you want it to be. And yeah, that should work. That should work beautifully. Wheels all nice and clean. Let's pop the tire back on, seat the beads, and balance the wheel. Then we'll reinstall. Oh yeah, stomp grip, tank grips. Much larger than the tech spec. A little bit harder to get on, but I think they look really, really good. And like I said, I got the clear, because I wanted to go with clear this time rather than black. It still allows the tank shine to come through, and I like that. But yeah, nice grips. A bit more expensive than tech spec. I think they were like $79. But like I said, they're... 40-50% larger and they're textured really really nicely all right let's continue our ride